Traders, we are quickly going to cover the line chart on TradingView. Now, for many of you, you are already familiar with what a line chart is, but this video is for all of the newcomers to market so that you know how to utilize every chart type available to you on TradingView. And keep in mind, our YouTube channel covers all of these different chart types, as does our help center. Now, as you can see here, we have line selected, and thus the chart shows a line. And this line is constructed based off of two key things. First of all, we are looking at a daily chart. That means each point on the line, when you move your mouse, you can see here it automatically snaps, is showing a specific day. So if we move our mouse over this chart, the line will snap and we can quickly see what the price was on the specific day. And keep in mind, you can see the date right down here at the bottom as well. So we have all of this information plotted on a wonderful line chart. Now, if we double click on this line chart, it's important to know that it says here, price source close. This chart settings menu gives us the capability to fully customize our line chart, meaning how do we want each price point to be plotted on the chart? Because we have close selected, this means that each price point on the chart is going to be plotted based off of the closing price of this specific time interval that we have selected or this specific symbol that we're looking at. Now, in this example, we're looking at Eli Lilly. It's a healthcare stock, trades on the New York Stock Exchange. So at 4 p.m. Eastern time, when the New York Stock Exchange closes, depending on where Eli Lilly is trading at, currently about $946, $947 a share, that is the line that will be plotted right here on the chart. And that is because we are implicitly saying price the closing price or source the closing price. If we wish, we can click the drop down and select a different source price of our needs. So if you wanted to see just the open and have that plotted each day, you can see the open. And you'll notice the line changes and that happens naturally because obviously the closing price is not always the same as the opening price. So depending on what you're looking for, what you're looking to analyze, the type of trader or investor you are, you can change how your line is plotted depending on the price source. Now keep in mind that OHLC is a common trader term that stands for open, high, low, close. So you can also select one of these calculations depending on high plus low divided by two, high plus low plus close divided by three, open high low close divided by four and if you really pay attention here you're getting an average of these four data points that are often recognized in markets so when we have open plus high plus low plus close we are summing up the open high low and close of each day because there's obviously an open there's obviously a close there's a high point in that day and a low point then we're dividing by four to see what the average is and we're plotting that on the chart as a line so this is the line chart and how to understand it. And there are a few more key details for us to explain just so that you know how to utilize the line chart the best of your ability. You can fully customize your line chart. Now check out our line chart right here as we change the color. So depending on how you want your line chart to look, you can fully customize it with the color of your choice. And of course, as always, you can also match that with a background of your choice by utilizing the canvas. So depending on what type of chart you want to create for your setup, you have that ability to do just that. Now, a few more final things is to make sure you understand your precision, which means how many decimal points do you want to see, and your time zone, which currently we have set to exchange. We're looking at the New York Stock Exchange. So this line chart is set to the New York Stock Exchange. We are also recording this video from Manhattan, New York City. It's currently 11.09 a.m., about to be 11.10 a.m., so you can have your line chart also plotted on the time scale down here and according to the time zone that is most relevant to you or most relevant to the exchange. So that is the introduction to the line chart. And now you have a video to understand the key concepts of it, how to read it and how to get started. And as a final tidbit, just remember all of this information applies to other time intervals. So if we do a 30 minute chart on a line chart, well, now we're looking at every 30 minutes plotted as a line. And if we move our mouse over this line, we are going to see that 30 minute price as we move our mouse backward. So thanks so much for watching. We hope this video helped. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. 
and let us know if you have any questions or comments and check out our help center for more.